As you've talked about Donald Trump's attributes and why he may be tapping into uh, the support that he has, it sounds to me that, you know, that there's some approval on your part. Is he on a list of uh, possibilities for you to endorse? Well, yes, and there are 16 others, of course, that are on that list in varying degrees. But you haven't ruled out Donald Trump. Oh, I surely wouldn't rule out Donald Trump. Uh, he's, he has shown a confidence in leadership, and he's been able to step forward and say things that were true. He's been attacked for these things, and they've turned out to, many of them, be true. Uh, for example, he was criticized when he announced that he would have 15,000 people at the rally he did in Arizona some weeks ago. And the press reported that he got around four to 4,500 people there. Well, I have a friend down there who's a former state senator, president of the state senate. I talked to him at random. He didn't know why I was quizzing him. When we added up all the people that he knew were there, it came to more than 15,000. Uh, Donald Trump has turned out large numbers of people. He's tapped into that nerve. Now, let's see how far it goes. We've been in no place like this in history before. Ross Perot didn't do this to this kind of magnitude. We've never had a candidate that came in from the outside and launched himself early and sustained an ascending campaign. We'll see if Donald Trump can do that. It doesn't worry you at all that he has not ruled out running as a third party or independent candidate should he um, not feel like the Republican Party is including him or, or you know, if he's not the nominee. Does that, or, he, you know, to uh, not pledge that he would endorse the eventual Republican nominee. Does that worry you? If I were advising Donald Trump today and he being where he is in the polls, I think it would be foolish for him to rule out a third party run because of this. He's at the top of the polls. So why should he be making decisions on what he, what he might do if he, doesn't, if he doesn't win the nomination from the Republican Party? Furthermore, some of the efforts on, on many in the party will be to try to marginalize Donald Trump. Well, if they push him and marginalize him, the fear that he might run as a third party candidate tends to restrain those who would like to marginalize him. So tactically, this is a good position for Donald Trump to be in. And if it comes down to that point of a decision to run as a third party candidate, that would not be my advice to Donald Trump. Okay, because Donald Trump right. has said himself, uh, that would be handing the election to the Democrats uh, if, he, if somebody like mm -hmm. him ran as a third party candidate. Strategically, he's, he's saying the right things given where he sits in the polls and the campaign that he's doing.